All right, YouTube. Let me show you something about the meteor. This is a fireball red meteor 2021. And what we have done is that we have taken out the muffler, including the cathode converter, as you can see here. And what we are going to do basically is cut open this entire section pull out the converter the, the catalytic converter and weld it back again make this a hollow resonance chamber and we're expecting this to do a little bit of good as far as the free flow is concerned of course you have these multiple chambers here in uh, the end can but then with all this resistance gone it should be a little bit of help uh, as far as the airflow is concerned and should make it sound a little better but before we do that and right now we are at a welder as you can see there is a big truck in front of me these guys do heavy work but somehow i have convinced them to work on this one so what i'm going to do right now is give you a taste of the sound without any muffler Sounds masculine, doesn't it? Hang tight for the rest of the work.
अब इसका क्या करेंगे वो जो पत्ती है लास्ट में ये वाली हाँ उल्टा उसको सपोर्ट रहेगा सपोर्ट रहेगा Okay, we are home after the job. I thought I'll see how well the camera, the microphone captures the difference in sound after we have made the catalytic converter box absolutely hollow. Let's see.
I'm not sure if it's visible here, but if you take a look, this is what the CatCon box looks after the not so choppy well job. Uh, inside this, I'll have some pictures, I'm sure, but what what was inside is actually uh, you see this uh, the inlet tube it, it ends right after it enters the catcon box and then after that uh, the outlet consists of a cone which is attached to a cylinder that cylinder is what has the filter which acts as the converter so it basically mutes the sound a lot and um, we've cut that straight from this section so now we have two pipes inside and they both end right where they enter the box so what this is is actually an expansion chamber of a hollow expansion chamber with no obstructions and it's made the sound a lot deeper uh, the bass has gone up this will need to be cleaned a little bit more uh, we have a couple of things here as you can see this portion has got damaged during the weld but it's okay we can file this away uh, that's it uh, it's become a little smoother as far as the ride is concerned the revs uh, uh, they go a little you know higher up so that's a good thing because all that resistance in the form of catalytic converter is gone uh, it's not in compliance with the with the rules and the laws uh, this is no longer a BS6 compliant machine even though on paper it is but that's okay and I don't recommend this to uh, anyone but I couldn't stop myself from trying this out. The next thing that we are going to do is we are going to make this entire end can a straight unit without any compartments. So we are going to cut that, the internal compartments. You have one and two out here, and you have one out here. That's the third one, and probably one somewhere in the middle. So there are like four or five chambers inside. We're going to make uh, it straight from here to there. It's not going to be, uh, it's not a super easy job and I don't want to tear the end can open apart. That's going to make it look very ugly. But the best part is that since the end can is a separate unit, what it does now is that it allows us to play a little bit with the exhaust combinations. Now if you know Royal Enfield has legal aftermarket exhausts which are below the 80 decibel sound limit or noise limit so I can try one of those or maybe I can go for a Red Rooster which is uh, a free flow can with a decibel killer so if you you know mm, it's a little on the expensive side, it costs about 10,000 Indian rupees, which is approximately uh, how much is that? It's uh, 110 pounds, and that's a good amount of money. But, anyways, um, we'll see if we are going to go that route. But for now, this is what it is. It has been a satisfying ride, and if it pleases you, I'm gonna play the soundtrack for you one more time. Alright people, enough for today, ciao.